Are they ready? Ooh, yum, 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 yum. I just love banana pancakes. So delicious, so yummy, and so good for balancing on a plate. That reminds me of our new sport. Come into the backyard and I'll show you. Right after I finish my banana pancakes. They're very good. <laughs> Have you got your fast, fast running feet? Oh yeah, I got my fast, fast running feet. Well, have you got your big, strong muscles? Oh yeah, I got my big, strong muscles. It's playing sports at home, yeah. I've got a whole new sport ready to set up. You watch and see if you can figure out what sport we're playing today. <laughs> Very good. Easy. Did you guess what sport we're playing today? Yep, it's tennis. I set up a big tennis net. I wonder, do you have a tennis net at your house? You could build one, you know. You could build one out of chairs. Or tables. Or even a skipping rope. Now that we've got our tennis net, all we need is a racket. Now, I think I left my racket somewhere. Let's just see if this works and... Uh, uh, yeah. No, javelin. Uh. Uh, no, hurdle. Ah, uh. uh, there we go. Tennis racket. Now, I need to talk to you about tennis rackets because tennis rackets are dangerous. Tennis is one of the most dangerous sports we play because you see this? It's not soft like a pillow, ow. It's actually really hard. So if you've got a tennis racket, could you swing it around like crazy all over the place? All crazy all over the place and go No, imagine if it hit you on the head. You've got to be really careful with tennis. And I like to be careful with a delicious banana pancake. Ah, here it is. Just get my uh, um, num, 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 a yummy banana pancake. I'm always very careful. Sometimes I give it a little wiggle, but I'll never ever drop it. I'm very careful with my... Oh man, I dropped my pancake. I wonder if you could be even more careful than me. Have you got something to balance with at your house? You can balance with so many things, like maybe a pancake on a tennis racket, or maybe some socks on a plate, or maybe even, or even, oh, a teddy bear on a book. <gasps> that reminds me of the balancing song. Check this out. Could you balance with a racket? I can balance with a racket. Could you balance with a jacket? I can balance with a jacket. Could you balance with a bat? I can balance with a bat. Could you balance with a hat? I can balance with a hat. But please just know that you can't balance with a cat. Could you balance with socks? I can balance with socks. Could you balance with a box? I can balance with a box. Could you balance with a bear? I can balance with a bear. Could you balance over there? I can balance over there. But please just take some care 
You can't balance on the air. Oh, 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 oh. Could you balance with a book? I can balance with a book. Could you balance while you cook? I can balance while I cook. Could you balance over here? I can balance over here. Could you balance really near? I can balance really near. But let me be quite clear. You can't balance on your ear. Huh? And everybody knows. You can't balance on your nose. And please remember that. You can't balance with the cat. Did you find something to balance with? Then let's practice our skills. I've got my banana pancake on a racket. You might have your uh, socks on a plate. Bear on a hook. Ready to go. All right, come on, tennis racket. We gotta practice some skills. Let's see if you could do a little wiggle with your pancake or your bear or your socks. Little wiggle and stop. Well done. See if you can do a little wiggle to make it go far away. Oh, all the way to the end and stop. Perfect. Now all the way back close to you. Close, close, close and stop. Let's do that a bit faster. Far away, far away, close, 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 and far away, far away, and close, close, close. Well done. That was really good. <sighs> Not again. <sighs> Silly pancake, get back here. Maybe you could even do it with one hand. Little wiggles all the way around, and uh, I hope you're being more careful than I am. I keep dropping my pancake. Get back here, Mr. Pancake. Maybe if you're a big kid, you could even try something trickier. Check this out. I'm going to do a little jump. Oh, and catch. It even did a flip. Let's try that again. Whoa, I wonder if you could do that. I'm gonna try it with one hand. Oh, I did another flip, this is amazing. And my other hand, it's very tricky. So don't be sad if you can't do it straight away. You just need to keep on practicing and then you'll be able to do lots of flips, just like this. <laughs> Let's see if we can flip socks on a plate. All right, socks on a plate, get ready to flip. And that's how you flip socks on a plate. <laughs> what about a teddy on a book? A wiggle, 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 lying on his back and lying on his nose. Poor Mr. Teddy. And excellent. One hand wiggles, make sure you never do Not again. I'll just show you one more thing for you big kids that want to try something really tricky. You can do with one hand, oh, and then catch it with your other hand. Whoa, that is tricky. You might even be able to spin it around and catch. Throw, spin, and catch. Throw, spin, and catch. That's pretty tricky. You might even be able to throw it to your mum or dad. Let's see if I can do five catches with Sarah. And one, two, three, four. Can we get five? Yeah, five. Well, we've definitely done lots of practice. I think it's time for me to set up a tennis balancing adventure. Maybe you could set up an adventure in your backyard. Check this out. Whoa, a whole tennis balancing adventure set up in my backyard. I wonder if you could set up something like this at your house. Spots for jumping, but you could use anything. Uh, hoops for twisting all around, but you could go around anything. I've got a box to climb over. I've got a skipping rope to go under. This is gonna be fun. On your marks, get set, go Coach Gareth. All right, I'm off and racing. I'm gonna come around this one. All the way around, I'll twist around yellow. Twist around Mr. Blue. Twist around the green one, up on the box. Yeah, jump down onto the balancing rope. All right, Coach Gareth, you've gotta be very careful for this one. A very, very, very careful. Oh no, I dropped it again. Get back here, Mr. Pancake. I'm gonna take you back 
to the start, all the way around, underneath. Oh no, this will be tricky. Gotta be little like a little puppy dog to get under this one. I did it. And a hop. A hop. Hop, this is easy. Hop. Hop. And I did it. Yeah. <sighs> I'll have to try again. But this time, I'm gonna get my teddy bear on a book. <laughs> oh yeah, this is gonna be fun. Oh, watch out, Mr. Teddy Bear. <laughs> I've dropped him before I've even started. That's no good. Okay, Teddy Bear, let's go for a tennis adventure. Bounce him on the book with one hand this time. We'll go all the way around, all the way around. <laughs> oh no. All the way around, all the way around. Step up on this box. Perfect. Make sure you're very careful as you go around. Careful, careful, and uh, yes. I told you it was easy. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, I dropped the teddy. Get back here, Mr. Teddy. <laughs> Where'd he go? <laughs> I'll come around here. Underneath again. Oh, one hand, remember Coach Garrett? One hand and one foot. This is gonna be so difficult. Oh, 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 jump and... Oh, no, not again. I wonder what kind of balancing adventure you could build at your house. Sorry about that, Mr. Teddy. Sorry for dropping you on the ground like three times. I might just put you over here. <sighs> well, if you know anything about tennis, you know that we can't play real tennis with pancakes or teddies or socks. We can't play real tennis with pancakes, teddies and socks. We need to find some tennis balls. I'm going to teach you how to do some proper tennis shots. Come and check this out. Punch volleys. It's when you hold the racket with two hands and bring it right in front of your nose so you can look through the strings and you go three, two, one, punch. Three, two, one, punch. Punch volleys are a great way for you to learn your first big tennis shots. You might even get your mum and dad to help you do some little throws. So you could go three, two, one, punch. Three, two, one, punch. If you don't have a tennis racket, don't worry. You can just use a plate and you put it just under your nose. Three, two, one, punch. Three, two, one, punch. It's gonna be so much fun. Maybe Sarah could come and do some punch volleys with us. Come on over, Sarah. I've got a racket just for you. Hello. I'll give the racket to Sarah and I'll go and get all of the tennis balls so we can do some punch volleys. See you on the other side of the net. All right. I've got all of these tennis balls right here, ready to go. Let's find out if Sarah is any good at punch volleys. All right, Sarah, put the racket right in front of your face. Three, two, one, punch. Three, two, one, punch. Oh no, she does look good at this. I hope it's not too scary. Okay, Sarah, on your marks. Three, two, one, punch. Ooh, she nearly hit me. Three, two, one, punch. Ah! She got my, me on my poor little hand. Three, two, one, punch. Three, two, one. Bah, bush, bush, bush. Oh. This is getting a little crazy. I might even try throwing them a little faster for Sarah. All right. Three, two, one, punch. Three, two, one, punch. Three, two, one. Whoa. She got me on my belly. This is getting crazy. I think it's my turn to have a turn to be the punch volleyer. Sarah, would you like to throw some for me? Let's trade places. <laughs> Let's see how this one goes. Now I've got the racket. Okay, so Coach Gareth, you gotta put it right in front of your face. And, okay, I'm ready. Three, two, one, punch. Yeah, I got it. 
Three, two, one, and punch. Yeah, I got it. Three, two, one, punch. Oh, I nearly got Sarah. Three, two, one, and punch. Whoa. Three, two, one, and punch. Oh, man. <sighs> she got me right on my belly again. <laughs> I hope you can have lots of fun playing punch volleys at your house. Just get your mum and dad to do some little throws for you and try not to get donged on the nose. Thank you so much for playing tennis with us today. It's been so much fun. I wonder what your favourite thing was. We made pancakes. We practised our balancing. Then we did a big balancing adventure around the garden. Oh, there was the balancing song. And then punch volleys. Three, two, one, punch. You could do punch volleys with a banana pancake on a racket, socks on a plate, or even a teddy on a book. And <laughs> teddy, don't fall on your face. Oh, could you just make sure Teddy is all right there? I wonder what your favorite thing was. Sarah, what did you like today? I liked the balancing adventure. Mm, that was really fun. I think my favorite was making a balancing song. That was really fun. <laughs> well, there's two things that you need to learn this week. You need to find something that you can balance with at your house and then set up a big balancing adventure in your backyard. That could be so cool. You could balance around trees or anything really. And the second thing, you need to practice your punch volleys. Three, two, one, punch. You might even practice with socks. <laughs> Next week, we're going to learn about running smashes where you point to the ball. You think I'm gonna get you ball and smash. And we're gonna learn backhands. And we're gonna learn forehands. Oh, it's gonna be so much fun. And just remember, Tennis can be a bit dangerous, so just be careful when you're holding the tennis racket. Isn't that right, Gareth? Gareth? Are you eating a banana pancake? It's very good. <laughs> See you next time, everybody. <laughs> I think that was good. I think so, too. Thanks, girl. You rock. Play sports at home, yeah.